All right, this is another 34, uh, 34 6. Uh, glory days, uh, next intention, stay classy. Uh, glory days aboard Upper Hand uh, well, it was primarily just used uh, there at uh, Hilty and Sloan's there for uh, a couple seasons, uh, and uh, uh, Travis put him in stud there, I want to say last fall, and, and uh, I was real excited to get him in a sow, um, and specifically this sow. And, and, uh, uh, really, uh, really enjoy this gilt, Clay. Um, she is, uh, you mentioned it on one another one, uh, but this cross gilt has got, uh, got a lot of miles in her. Yes. And uh, she can show for a while, uh, but that is an elite head and neck. That is an elite arm, uh, and she is a stout, stout-footed one. Yeah, and when she leaves you, she plants them square on the corners with good uh, good big toes, stout skulled, but still clean about her jawline. Got a really good look and elevation about her. Um, looks like another one. You know, you could start showing her at 100 pounds and just show her all day long and, and for as long as you want to, and she's going to be uh, in the mix of things. And from a long-term perspective as a gilt, I really think, you know, her value uh, after she's done showing could be very high too with, with the pedigree. And um, coming out of a deep litter, I always tell people, uh, buy gilts out of deep litters if you want to, to make consistent litters in the future, and I think this one can do that. So, again, that is 34-6, uh, uh, cross gilt, glory days, next intention, uh, stay classy.